Hello, good morning everyone. Welcome to Mauricia's Kitchen. And today we're going to showcase how to make some scrambled tofu with sausage. Yes, I said sausage. Of course, you know it's vegan. And it's called tofurkey. Tofurkey Italian sausage. It is really, really, really good. Unfortunately for me, I can't have it because it's, it has gluten, so it sucks. So I'm making this for my husband who doesn't have the same intolerance that I do. So, you know, I'm making it for him. I'm treating him to breakfast today. So I'm going to show you how to make scrambled tofu, which is a mock scrambled eggs with sausages, which is, you know, doesn't come from any animal products. So this, this dish is definitely vegan. You can make this if you don't have anything against soy. This is organic tofu with no preservatives that I bought at Trader Joe's. But you can check any of your local grocery store or you can check your health food store. So like your um, Trader Joe's, your health foods, any mom and pop natural food store may carry this. So let's move this on. I'm going to use, for seasons, I'm going to use onion powder, garlic powder, and sea salt. And I want to make sure you, so you know where I'm using this from. I'm using it from Redmond's Real Sea Salt. Okay, so that's the salt I'm using. And I'm going to give it its color, something called turmeric. Turmeric, turmeric, however you want to say it. Hopefully you can see that. You can get that at your, any local food store. You just ask them for their seasons, where their seasons are, and ask for turmeric, turmeric, turmeric. <laughs> so, and it's really good. All the, Some of these foods that I'm using and ingredients are definitely help, that would help for your health. And then I'm going to use a little bit of olive oil, just a little bit so it doesn't stick and flow. Um, I don't use a lot of oils, but I may use some just for certain dishes so the food won't stick. Okay, so this is what I'm using. So I'm going to add a little bit while the pan is a little on, uh, just a little bit so you can see that. And I already crushed the scrambled tofu. You would strain the water and then, you know, just, you know, chop it up like this so it gets the, you know, so it looks scrambled. So I'm going to put this. I did have the heat the stove on and so you might hear a little sizzling. Get all that in there. Now I'm also going to add the sausages and what I did is cut them up like this. And I kind of like pre-cooked it already. So what you would do normally would you would add the sausage first and then let that cook up and then add your tofu. So I'm doing it the opposite way this time around. So hopefully you can see that I already sliced them up already. So I'm going to add that in there. Hopefully you can see that. and I'm going to put my oven my stove just a little higher now I'm going to add my seasoning because I, I want the flavor to get in everything so you do it how you want to do it I'm just showing you just kind of foundational step and then you can maneuver how you like it you can doctor it up okay I'm going to add the turmeric and I'm just going to use a spoon I don't want to use too much, but enough to get it the color that I want because turmeric does have a, a type of flavoring that if you put too much, it can be bitter, okay? So I'm going to put that here. And then we're going to mix it all up. Hopefully you can see that. Now, if it doesn't get the color that I want, I may put another spoon, but I just want to put one spoon first to see how the color. Hopefully you can see that. I'm going to put my stove a little higher. Okay. Can you see that? Now, for your eggs, like we, you can actually add your onions, your bell peppers if you like. The same way you like to make your scrambled eggs, you can just do the same. The only difference is that you won't be having real eggs. So I only use a spoon so you can actually see the color changing from white to yellow. Wow, that's beautiful already. There you go. And you know what? You can make this and flavor it really nicely and no one will know. Okay. 
Just want to make sure everything looks nice and yellow. I'm big on color with food. Don't want to look bland. Okay. I think we almost got everything in there. Okay. Okay, so we got that. Put that here. Now we're going to do like a teaspoon. You can add a teaspoon of the garlic powder or half a teaspoon. I would say half a teaspoon. And then you would add actually a teaspoon of the onion powder. Okay. Now I'm going to mix that in before I add my salt. Now, if you add a nice amount of garlic and, you know, onion powder, depending on if you have high blood pressure and you want to lessen the salt intake, but you want your food to be flavorful, add more herbs to your food. And even though I don't recommend cooking heavily with cayenne pepper, you just add a little bit of pinch of cayenne pepper just to lift up the flavoring and then lessen the salt intake if salt is an issue for you. Okay, now I'm going to add sea salt. Now, you're going to add according to your taste and according to your health as well. And so I'll probably add a teaspoon or half a teaspoon. So, but you want to Add and taste as you go to see so if you need to add more because once you add too much you can't you can't take it away so I'm going to taste a little doesn't that look pretty look at that look at that okay let's see what it tastes like perfect don't need to add any more salt oh this is beautiful now I'm going to add and it's not necessary, my chicken likes seasoning. Add a little bit of that in there. Now, I would add only a little bit of salt because I do add a little bit of um, um, salt to this. So this is my chicken likes seasoning. If you're interested in purchasing my chicken likes seasoning, you can use it on everything. Just email me at thevital8 at gmail.com or go to my website, mariciaanglade.com and message me there. Okay, we are done with the sausage. Oh, I dropped one. Here, right here. Let's clean this up right there. Okay, so wait one minute. Now you can definitely make this with toast, okay? Or garnish it with your favorite dish. Voila. Scrambled tofu with tofurkey sausage. This was M saying, Girl, what you eating? <laughs> See you later. This is M, Marisa Apple on Anglade, your lifestyle health coach and motivational speaker on health and happiness.